And here, Aubrey Smallwood. Aubrey, I don't know if you need 20 strikeouts. I think that's your career high. 10 to start the game. Let's talk about what was working for you today. I just went in today um, just with a clean mindset. And my rise ball was real good today. My curveball was real good today. I just feel like I had a good day like on the mound completely. And I felt good knowing my defense had my back if the ball got hit. We talked about this before. You kind of – your person that gets up for the big, these bigger games. They're a real – they're single A, but a very good team. They lost one game. Real good freshman pitcher. Did you get a little bit more up to this one because they were hitting the ball so well? Yes. Um, that pitcher, she's a great pitcher. Um, freshman, too, that's huge. And she's going to be really, really good and really tough next year as well. Um, going into this game, I knew they were losing, They lost one game this season. And um, there, I knew, like, after the score of last time's game, it was going to be a tough game. When you talk about her being good, when did you know you were going to be good? I mean, you're at, 260, you're at 267 on strikeouts now. When did you know you could dominate the way you've been able to this year? Just, I worked real hard in the off season this year, like gaining some speed. Um, last year, I realized that I needed some more speed on me um, if I was going to go anywhere, and I think that paid off for me. Is that the major difference between you this year and you last year? I mean, you were pretty good last year. Too. Yes, I think this year I have gained a little bit of speed, and I think that's what put me up to the next level. Anything tell you today you might have a good game? I mean, uh, you struck at the first 10. I don't know if you started like that before, but uh, let's talk about that start first. Ken oh, the start, start, I knew I was on from the start, um, and everything was working for me. I just felt good about this game tonight. Uh, when did you, did you have a feeling today this might be one of, a, a day when you're, you know, you had a chance to maybe do something special? Sometimes people, athletes have premonitions that they might do. Yeah, I, going in today, um, I struggled yesterday, so I was due. And I knew going into the day that I needed to warm up better than I did yesterday. And after I threw the first couple pitches of the game, I knew I was just going to be on tonight. I talked to pitchers about uh, get their out and mouth their youth. I know that they've been kind of holding back. You know, you started, I think, all three games this week. Do you think your players can start a week if they need you to do that? Yeah, I think I do. I, could, I think I could start every game, but I probably couldn't finish every game. Um, I need some help for sure out there, but I think I could do it if I needed to. Well, you, you're, you didn't lose a lot on your uh, velocity today. Mm -hmm. Is that something you work on you work so you could keep maintaining that velocity in the later innings? Yes. Um, I warm up with these weighted balls, and I throw sand balls at them, and I think that's what really increased my velocity tonight. Who's the best pitcher you guys have seen this year? The best pitcher we've seen this year is, I think, Delaney Buckland. Um, I, she just has killer movement, and it's very hard, but she is definitely in the top three. All right. Hey, I appreciate it. I appreciate Great you. Job. Thank, Thank you. you.